Hello and welcome my dear students to my channel Mathematics Made Easy. This video is specially for my grade 9 elite students. And finally we are on the last learning objective of part 1 for your end of term free math exam coverage. So let's start this video and see what questions are we solving today. The learning objective then this is the last video on part 1 uh, for this session for grade 9 elite. So here the learning objective says describe events as subsets of sample spaces by using intersections and union. So here these question if you see carefully ask you on intersection inverted u. If I write a intersection b means I need the common outcomes which are there in both a and B. So let's see how event A is defined in question 1. This is the event of rolling an even number and the experiment is that the fair die is rolled. So if you see the total sample space when a die is rolled any number can come 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So there are total 6 outcomes and out of this event A is defined as getting an even number. So the outcomes will be only the even numbers 2, 4 and 6. Let's define event B. Event B is the event of rolling a number greater than 4. Means if it is greater than 4, 4 is not included. We start from 5 and 6. So now what is the common outcome? We need A intersection B. That means which is the common outcome having both A and B. So if you see 2, 4, 6 is there in A and 5 and 6 is in B. So there is only one common outcome. That is the number 6. So common outcome is only number 6. So this is one favorable outcome out of a total of 6 outcomes. So from these 6 total outcomes we have only one option. So the probability for this question is going to be 1 by 6. The formula that we have used is probability of an event is equal to favorable outcomes divided by total outcomes. Now if you see the question carefully it only asked you for A intersection B. It just asked you for the sample space. So your answer would be for A intersection B as the number 6 only. However, if they ask you probability of A intersection B, then you take the favorable outcome which is 1 out of 6 and give this as your answer. I hope the difference is clear and let's now move on to question 2. In question 2, the same experiment is happening. The fair die is rolled. Event A is defined as rolling an even number and B is defined as rolling an odd number. Now this is an easy one. If it is even, it is going to be 2, 4, 6. If it is odd, it's going to be 1, 3, 5. And definitely even and odd are opposites of each other. So if you want to calculate the intersection or the common outcome, there will be nothing. It is going to be the empty set. So because it does not have any common outcome, uh, A intersection B is going to be the empty set and the probability, if you want to go further and find the probability since there is no common outcome, it will be 0 over 6 which is 0. So the final answer here is 0. This is the probability for A intersection B for question 2. For this short video, which was on the topic of intersections and probability. So with that, we have completed part one. Stay glued to my channel to have more videos for revision based on part two and part three for grade nine elite. Until then, this is Ms. Ruchika signing off from today's video. If you liked the video and found it useful, don't forget to share it with your friends, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Bye-bye.